Okay guys, today we are going to be talking about a member from Neo YZK original youngins based to Harlem, New York. Before we start drop a like and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos. Alright let's jump back into the video. Jeremy Sanchez, also known as Oi Jamie, was known for his role in a film called Toddlers that was made to highlight where incidents goes wrong which leads to gun violence. Sanchez's role in the film was played as teen gangster named Jay. Anything, just let me know. You know All right. All right. And then, what you need to be doing is trying to swing a bat, not a gun, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I understand you, but I gotta do what I gotta do, though. Go ahead, little nigga. Do your thing. Yo, I appreciate it, though, man. Yeah, hurry up, get up out of here, fuck off. There's nothing but revenge on these motherfuckers. Fuck all these niggas. We already know who killed my pops. This is life or death right now. Yo, Jay! Yo, Dick, she in there! She in there? Yeah, she in there, come on! Yo, where the fuck she at? What the fuck is this? I don't got time for your dumb shit. You on the fucking floor! Many anti-violence advocates claim glorify gang life, but this was denied as the, the intentions of the movie was to give insights to the violence that occurred in the rough streets of Harlem to see where these incidents could be prevented. Director Termaine Brown, known as M5, said he chose real children from rough neighborhoods rather than actors to reflect reality. That's what's going on. I'm just showing it, he said. You hear about these murders. But people don't see how it happens. I show how these incidents happen. These are real life situations. Unfortunately, on July 15, 2012, Sanchez would make a horrible decision to turn the gun on an individual in real life. At the age of 16, Jeremy Sanchez was accused of being a stick up man in a Washington Heights armed robbery attempt. Sanchez would later be arraigned on murder and weapons charges before pleading not guilty. As time went on, Sanchez would confess to hunting down Archbold, 19, and a friend on July 15th about 2 a.m. On W 135th Street near Lenox Avenue we started chasing them, Sanchez told investigators when he was arrested August 29th. I went after one, but he got away. When I came back, Archbold was being beaten up. I had a 380 pistol, and I shot him three times. The 19-year-old victim, Archbold grew up in Harlem, but moved to Teaneck, New Jersey, with his aunt to get away from the gun violence in the neighborhood, his mother said. The night of the shooting, he was back in the area for a friend's party. The victim's mother says she was sickened to see Sanchez toting a gun in the trailer. He thinks he's living out a movie my son is gone. He's not coming back. His daughter is going to have no father. I don't think he understands that. Jeremy Sanchez would later be convicted of the 2012 Harlem murder of Kenneth Archbold and would receive a minimum of 25 years in prison for the crime. This defendant seeing Kenneth Archibald being beaten for no reason Rather than step up and help Mr. Archibald, pulled a gun and shot him three times. Jeremy Sanchez, at the time this incident took place, was 16, barely 16 years of age. Um, he lived with his mother um, and his sister and his family came here from uh, another country. They were all proud to be here in this country. Um, they're hardworking people, um, and as much as um, the uh, deceased uh, mother um, and family uh, believed in their son, uh, Jeremy's family believed in him. He was so loving, so sweet. He was always known for the biggest smile ever. He always greeted you with a big hug and always polite and respectful. The moment I was told I could speak to his murderer. Before sentencing today, I was consumed with so much different emotion because the first day that we appeared in court, I saw his face and I too was overwhelmed with his age and said to myself, damn this kid, this is just a kid also. I just want to tell his mom and his family that I'm sorry for the law. That's what I want to say. 